Good morning. Hello again. I'm Max McGee. 825 AM, 43 degrees. All right, Marty, we're moving right along despite the cloudy start to the day. And yeah, we get we get some sun in here. It, it, it certainly is mild. 52 is going to be your high this day. Stroke of midnight. Call it 40. Overnight tonight, it will get rather cloudy again. A low of 34 degrees. Take it away, Sherry. Well, we have enjoyed a very mild morning commute on this last day of 2019. If you are just about to head out, only one wreck out there. It is going to be in the city on Reisterstown Road westbound at Northern Parkway. Otherwise, the west side of the Beltway has been delay free all morning, still running at 60 miles per hour. Top side running at 62 miles per hour. That is a look at a pretty empty top side of the Beltway there at Lock Raven Boulevard. Max, over to you. Police confirmed three people were killed in a shooting in North Baltimore late last night. Amy Rose Ramos with the latest. Max, good morning. Well, just hours after the mayor and police commissioner met to discuss the city's homicide rate, the city recorded its 347th killing in 2019. Now, Max, that means over a thousand people have been shot in this city since January of last year. Now, this is a record high rate per capita of killings. This is a rate higher here than in other cities like New York, Philadelphia, and Chicago. Reporting from City Hall, I'm Amy Rose Ramos for WJZ.